Hi, I'm Jessica Hirsch. I'm the founder of Cheat Day Eats and Your Room Service. And Cheat Day Eats is all things indulgent and basically my lifestyle and everything included. So it's all about me and what I enjoy in terms of restaurants and travel. I was a high school math teacher in the South Bronx and I absolutely loved my job. I never imagined doing anything else. And Instagram came about and I realized there was an entire community of people who were just as obsessed with food as I was. So I was super excited when I started getting into it and I would be posting all the food I love and uh, my account just picked up a lot of traction. Um, I picked up a Sony a6000 and with that came, you know, opportunities uh, for people to want to work with uh, cheat day eats and me and I never thought that there would be a job like the one I have today that I that I love this much. Uh, so I knew that that was something that I'm gonna take a chance on it and follow my passion and I'm really excited that I did. I had formed relationships with a lot of restaurants and um, a lot of them were interested in hiring me to run their social media because obviously I had built Cheat Day Eats enough to establish myself as someone who was knowledgeable in this field. And since in restaurants in New York City, uh, there's thousands. So how do you, you know, stick out? And honestly, social media can be one of those things that literally separates you from the rest. I think there is that difference between food photographer and food influencer. Um, what you see on my page is definitely not something that you would flip through in like in some food and wine magazine, but it has like this kind of in your face, different uh, element of it. I think people, they don't want to see this produced uh, setup. They want to see something that feels like they're at the table there with the food. The number one question is, do I eat everything that I post? And the answer is yes. Now that being said, if I have an entire pie in front of me, I did not eat that entire pie. I probably had a slice or two, uh, but then I'll take home the leftovers. We never want to waste any food. The food will be eaten, trust me. So uh, I work with Brian, who is my partner, manager, agent, fiance, <laughs> and I literally don't know what I would do without him because he's my number one supporter and I he, I don't know what I would do without him. So I feel like I'm gonna cry. <laughs>I mean, the main lens that I've been traveling with is the uh, G Master 2470. I think it's just super versatile, being able to get like a landscape shot or something, you know, like holding up, I have like a fry shot with like this beautiful alley in Brussels, um, being able to capture uh, the ambience and the environment, um, but then also being able to kind of just zoom in and get that detail. I think it just allows me to kind of be in the destination without having to like stop and change lenses. So anyone ever asks me like what what my setup is, I have the 7.3, um, the a7 III, and I love it. So I really have noticed an improvement in terms of like the color and the battery. Perfect for me as in terms of like all day I could shoot up with it.